Good morning. It is a cloudy day, but it's actually not clouds. It's fire smoke. Not really sure where that's coming from, but it's the middle of September. We still haven't got a big rain, so none of the fish have moved up to Capilano. They're all stacked up in Ambleside. I've been seeing people catch, and um, I just want to put my time in this morning, get a good three hours of fishing in. I bought a new GoPro. I'm hoping to do some live streams in the near future. Could not figure it out for this morning, but keep an eye out for that in the future, guys. Some weekend morning sometime. There will suddenly be a live stream. I hope you guys can tune in. But for today, let's try to catch Coho. Just chatting with a couple guys up on the shore. I guess Friday was awesome. Saturday morning was awesome. Um, and last night there were just like hundreds and hundreds of fish being caught um, up in the uh, the weirs above the bridge. Seems like the story is the tide change from low to high is the best time to uh, catch these guys. And I was talking to um, a guy that I met before. I actually showed one of his fish on the video before. He's a fly fisher and he was here the last couple days. And um, some of his go-to flies for coho here are giant pink streamer looking things or even um swinging flies yo oh yeah for sure i don't want to hook you thanks for letting me know nice cast <laughs> sun coming through the clouds and the smoke over there quite pretty like a little gateway to heaven or something Oh, I can see the flying V now. Flying V right there. Buddy. Just caught this guy midair. He's looking for a place to land. Here, you go on my go on my jacket. Right now there's a flying V straight ahead of me. Seal blocked it. It's nice to see the flying bees again. I have missed them. Gonna put on this uh, white minnow pattern, something larger, inspired by this gentleman who was catching with larger flies. Various colors. I'm using Orbis Nosh here to put this guy on. And I'm recording this on my Hero 10. Fancy new from yesterday from Costco. You just casting? Yeah, Woo. You need a hand? Where's my camera? Where's my camera? I'll help you look. <laughs> Here, I'll keep an eye on your spot. You want me to help? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, no worries. I'll keep your fish if you get the camera. Not my fish, guys, but I got to net it. <laughs> hey, you got lucky. You keep. You're keeping this, yeah. Yeah. Nice, nice fish. Just keeping them healthy until you bonk them. Thank you for helping. What a beautiful fish. Whew. Hey, thanks for uh, making my video better. <laughs> it's a win-win. Pink, huh? I'm gonna put pink on. Yeah. What a beautiful Thank fish. You so much. Of Thank course, you of course. Found a milk crate. What? what? That could actually come in handy. I'm gonna clean that up and take that home. Bunch of fish out by those guys. I gotta go further out. This morning. 
Everything's been interesting. So besides our buddy catching a fish and being awesome and letting us put it on video, I also saw a group of conventional guys casting right at a fly fisher who admittedly was kind of walking in front of where they'd been casting for the last hour. But uh, they had a little bit of a coral. And uh, now I just saw some guys north of the bridge yelling across the river to someone on the west side who is fishing the river and probably is new and doesn't realize that that's not allowed without permission. So, been an interesting morning here in the estuary. The fish have definitely moved out here. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, that's deep. Whoa, that was a big one. That was a big fish. My God, I don't know if you guys saw that splash. That was a big fish. I want to catch the big fish. Oh, these are big waves. They're killing me, oh God. I'll be on my tippy toes. Really? These leaky waders in waist high water are having uh, undesirable consequences. Yeah, lots of fish here. It's nice the fish finally showed up. I can't wait till we get our first high water. The river runs. I really want to hit the lower Capilano the first weekend after the, the fish start running. I set up some, uh, I got like a hoochie fly and three different eggs slash bead setups that I want to I want to drift through some uh, deep runs. Guys this is the last fly we're trying. This thing has weighted eyes and it's got some pink and a little bit of orange so let's give it a shot. There are so many big fish jumping out there. You want me to help you net? Shit. I'm sorry dude. Uh, it's all good. Uh, that's exciting anyway. Yeah. Got some adrenaline going. <laughs> Good luck. Now the guy's hooked up over there with a the big one. Seal. Another fly fisher just lost a fish. Three fly fishers, two to my left and one to my right, have all put a coho this morning. 